Hey guys, welcome back to another series. Uh, this time we are going to be playing Man of Medan. Um, I don't know a lot about this game other than it's a horror game and there's going to be a lot of quick time events. And uh, for those of you who don't know and haven't seen my other videos, I'm not the biggest fan of horror games. Like, I'm actually pretty terrible at them. So, um, yeah, let's see how this goes and hopefully I get to keep everybody alive. Don't play alone. Play with your friends or play alone. I'm going to play alone, unfortunately. Well, Chinese market, China South Sea. Here we go. Aren't familiar with uh, this game. Um, they're the same people who made Until Dawn, so obviously you're going to have a lot of choices, and depending on those choices, uh, some people will live and some people may die. So, um, yeah, hopefully, like I said, I, hopefully I'm able to keep everybody alive, but I doubt it. I'm going to do my best. It's already pretty creepy. All this cross imagery and death. All righty, Buster. We better mosey on back to the ship. Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Oh, boy. Let's have it. What's in Yo. store for me, Pop? Say not dubious. So, uh, when am I gonna hit the jackpot? You know, uh, all that glitz and glamour. I didn't even get a chance to choose. I'm like, what? Drag towel, bamboo towel, dragon towel. Uh,. Go with the dragon tile. This guy looks like a dragon tile kind of guy. Oh boy, what is it? Oh, a it fish. Looks like a fish? I have Alzheimer's. <laughs> or, I mean, Parkinson's. <laughs> What's up with these controls? What does that even mean? Doom? Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? Okay, so reckless, insecure, selfish, altruistic, guarded, and eager. Okay. This guy, um... Okay, I don't, I don't even know what to say about that. Well, let's see how this, this hey, goes. Bud, let me get a go at it. Oh, yeah? Think you got the stuff? Fine, sure. 
Let me know the quarter. We're gonna start a tab. Why does this man have his own money? I'll give it a whirl. Oh, I gotta aim with R and press R2? That's... I don't like that. <clears throat> I feel like that's pretty advanced for 1940s. Oh, they're testing how good I am. Quick time events. Getting crazy now. They speeding it up. Oh, man. Ooh, that was close. Oh, <laughs> damn. They finally got me. <laughs> they finally got me. Have a nice day. Hey, Chuck, we better get that ship. We don't want to get stranded. Come on, man. Just let me ask another question. We really need to get back. Altruistic, insecure, selfish, reckless. Okay. It's not somebody you'd want to be friends with this Joe. Come in too! Cargo hold too! Lot of dead people on this ship. Hey man. Hey, where's my where's my fifty cents? Fifty cents? Who fifty cents? Come on, oh, man. Oh my god. Hey, buzz all. Buddy. Nobody pushes me around. They're drunk. <laughs> oh shit. God, there's a leak on the boat? What the fuck? Bodies just start decomposing. Looks like a green fart taking over the ship. Damn, that guy punches hard. June 22nd, my birthday. Okay, what's this picture of? Some boy. 
two pops come back soon is this my son or just random kid there like that's weird why that random picture would be in the sick bay and not someone's room It is too early for the jump scares, my god. It's a rusted key. Why is there blood on my shoulder? This is the doctor? Damn, somebody did a number on him. Can I not, like, search him? I don't understand. He's just like... There's nothing on him I can, like, search. Okay. There's no point of showing me him, then. Like, come on, game. Oh, man. These controls are terrible. I have nothing left to see. Oh, damn. They really didn't want me to leave. Oh, my God. Howdy, children. How's your time off? Just get me out of here already. Oh, at least this guy's still alive. What the hell is going on up there? I heard aircraft and gunfire. Me too. And there was a... a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. Okay, let's see what's in here. that Private Charles Anderson on leave from duty did display intoxication in a manner not becoming of a member of the U.S. Army. Private Anderson was engaging with another soldier in a drunken argument. It is the opinion of the arresting officer that this would lead to public brawl and steps were taken to ensure that both men were returned to their ship. Brig 10 days approved. Damn, they're gonna lock my guy up for 10 days? Charles Anderson, private, public intoxication, brawling 10 days, Briggs found drunk and acting inappropriately for U.S. for U.S. Army personnel on shore leave, Joseph Roberts, private, public intoxication, brawling 10 days, okay, whatever. This information is not important to what's going on on this ship. Why is there blood in here? Why is there blood in here? What was he doing in here? Am I not going to bring that up to this guy? Like... It's weird that you can go in here and there's like nothing there. God, I hate these weird camera angles. Okay, now, now I'm upset because I feel like and I missed something that would allow me to get in there. And I feel like there might be something in there that I might need. Oh, what the fuck? Press X in with the heartbeat. Oh my god, like, why wouldn't they teach me how to do this beforehand? What 
is going in? Holy crap, that was intense. Okay, I really don't like that this game leads you to places that you can't do anything at. Like, why? That's such a waste of time and movement. In a game where moving is literally, literally terrible. Oh! What was that? Man, listen. Whenever you see kids running across something where they're not supposed to be, it's never good news. Oh my gosh, should I go there or should I go over here? I'm gonna go over here first. Whoa, no, that fart gas thing. What the frick? Alright, I'll just go here first. Let's see. Alright, well, you see, there you go again. Another locked door. I mean, why are you standing there and can I look there too? No, I cannot. Alright, so I have no choice but to look here. Hey, Charlie, help. Okay. Oh my god. I can't Fubar take this. I can't take this. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god, I just jumped back so hard. All these goddamn jump scares. Jesus. Dead. Another stick? Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Lovely. Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Now he's stiff as a fiddle. Haha. <laughs> Yo. Oh, man. This game is. This game is fun. camera angles my god listen if you guys just wanted to make a movie make a movie hold l1 to uh walk faster okay i guess oh god i did the one thing you're not supposed to do in horror movies and, and that's separate from the group i'm dead Oh, I'm super dead. So, uh, is it just me, or are you getting a real strange feeling right now? Do I look like a guy who likes to talk about his feelings? <laughs> you look like a mess on wheels, Chuck. I ain't the only one. Great. Good company. Let's just get up on that. Yeah, fine. Agree. Yeah. Oh, god damn it. Hey, Chuck? You see that kid over there? Uh, no. You feeling all right? Man, I gotta stop playing with headphones on. Charlie, get over here! Jesus. Finally. Got some weapons, yo. That would have been the first thing I would have tried to find was a gun or something. Oh my god, echoey child's laughter. Oh man. 
Wait, is that Charlie? Oh, God, no. Charlie! Oh, it is Charlie. even think about it I'm shooting that that's not no regular kid oh my god what I tell you oh how I just died from a heart attack That's crazy. Mayday! Mayday! Is anyone there? Hello! Can anyone out there hear me? Oh, come on! Come on, damn it! Oh, what the hell is that? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> My man brought out a cross. <laughs> Ow. What's up with this music, though? Sean Ashmore. Iceman. This is not like cop edit. I'm gonna have to mute this whole section. This place is so big, he needs a compass to get to where he's going. Crazy. Hello, and welcome to my repository. I don't even know what that means. I mean, listen, the guy dresses fly, I'm not even going to lie. I am the curator, the curator of stories, stories of love and hate, greed and beauty, life and death, stories such as this one. 
I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral compass. And we have to live with those decisions or die by them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes, eventually, to everybody. Still, none of us want That's for it morbid. to come too soon, do we? As in life, the actions you take matter. The choices you make will affect others. I'll be keeping a close eye on your progress. It's not my place to interfere, but I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. Here's one for free. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. Or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. That's all for the moment. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll have the opportunity to account for all the actions that you've taken. Or whatever mess you've made. Alrighty then. Duke Milan. Brad, Alex's brother, innocent, witty. Duke of Milan. Motivated, Alex, Brad's brother, Julia's boyfriend, insecure. Well, I'm gonna be Alex because my name is Alex, so I'm gonna make sure that this guy survives because he has my name. If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look, I've never been down there before. Down? The water, diving. Well, maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kind of, yeah. Insecure, resentful. It's... It's what? It's embarrassing taking them by yourself. It's embarrassing you came all the way out here expecting me to hold your hand. Oh, damn. Whoa, careful. That dive cam is, like, super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Uh, I was invited. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Julia wanted you to come along. <laughs> For real? Julia? Yeah, man. She wanted you to come. And I wanted her to see how cool you are, which you're not. So be cool. Capiche? <laughs> All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? Brotherly love. <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Your relationship updated. Truthful, innocent, witty, envious. Eager and anxious. Hey, so uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a 
big life choice, you know? How to know what's the right thing to do. Sentimental, cautious, give it some thought, go with your gut. Yeah, you know, give it some thought. If it's you sure you're ready? Give it some thought. Consider all the permutate. Bearing a proposal, Brad told Alex to think things through. Oh, damn, I didn't know they were talking about a proposal. Oh, well, well. Whatevs. Hopefully that doesn't get anybody killed. Hey! Julia, excited, reckless. Conrad's sister, Alex's girlfriend. Conrad, foolhardy, relaxed. Julia's brother. Oh, sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! I feel like I know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me. Hey, man. Want to crack a cold one with me? Every second. Huh. Uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would have gone with you. Yeah. Oh, I gotta play it cool. Cool. <laughs> Tight. I, I love beer. Relationship updated. Okay, so I guess they're getting along. I, did it go up? It kind of looks the same. All right, whatever. <laughs> God, this guy's awkward. <laughs> right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. Radical? It's jib. Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Um, no, actually. Never done it before. Water virgin. Nice. Hey, we're gonna pop your cherry together. Your what? Uh... This is like a frat bro. <laughs> full on. <laughs> Where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? Elise, impatient, courageous, captain of the Duke of Milan. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... Oh, she a tank, though. So is everybody on board and ready to go? She a little tank. Uh, she really is impatient. I'm selling, I'm buying. She didn't even introduce herself or not. She's like, let's get the fuck out of here. <coughs> oh, Brad. That's it. Get it all out. Uh, yeah. <coughs> you uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Little boy. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Optimistic, frustrated. All right, let's be optimistic. Brad did his homework. If he says a wreck's here, it's here. <laughs> Okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Fliss. Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, the kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Fliss, kids we found a, a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World what War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to Port Authority. 
as an unreported wreck? Well, Yo, why they messed up her teeth like that? Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Um, I'll say nothing, I guess. Guys, no one knows, no one cares. No harm, no foul. The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. Where's I just that can't accent wait to from? be the first one down there. French? Can you imagine? Untouched? <sighs> we should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera, see if you can find anything useful. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Yo, she's ripped. See them abs, yo? Damn. Okay. Hey, so, hey. So. Hi, sweetie. Almost got the gear good to go. Need an extra hand? Never used a rebreather before. I think we're in good shape. It's probably not a bad idea for you to have a clue how these things work. Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Um, I, 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 don't, I don't know, supportive? Seriously, where does she get off bitching about us? She's making a small fortune on this trip. Yeah, not that small. Rules are rules. I get it. But what's the big deal if nobody finds out? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're like all right. two feet away from her talking all this up, shit. And then we'll go through the final steps together. Cool. That was rude. Just holler at us when you're ready. Felicite Dubois. 1983. She does not look that old. This doesn't look kosher. Yeah, I'm questioning her ID now. Like, what's going on? This guy's kind of a douche. Do you know how to use that? Uh, no. Not really. Might want to just let it do its thing. Mm, I mean, I can't turn it back on, so I guess hopefully. I feel like any little choice I make is going to get somebody killed. Like, I just probably signed Brad's death warrant just now by turning that off. <laughs> What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. One beer, bro? Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Take more than that just to script the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Okay, so they have a good relationship, all right. I thought there was I'm not sure be like Julia left jumpsuit. anything on the mainland. Shroud of Innocence. Some perfume. It's only Dope. smelled as good as it cost. At least it made her happy. Shroud of Innocence. That all I can interact with here? I guess so. Oh, what's no? I wanted to see that picture. Mission unlocked, high and dry.
found during the wreck. I mean, that didn't really tell me anything. It's just Brad waking up. How is that informative whatsoever? There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Better not see any nudes on this thing. Tanks are ready. Tanks a lot. Zing. Oh, we're doing puns now? Just a bunch of water. Can't zoom in. So what do I, do I okay. talk to him? Okay. So this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Oh, she okay. got money, money. O2 check done. <laughs> whoa, 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 eager beaver. You gotta check your O2 first. Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate. I don't. What are these things? I don't know what they are. I'll take whatever. You're on camera. Oh, camera. I'll take the wheels. Let's get a before okay. photo. Um, all right, kids. Good she looks to go. so high. <laughs> Okay, so the relationships are going up. Just remember the rules, please. Talk, take. I'll talk to her, I guess. Bearing updated. Alex didn't take the bang stick on the die. Oh crap! I'm I'm dead. I'm I'm dead. Maybe we can fire it up again tonight for our private post dive special. <laughs> are you gonna bring your bang stick? <laughs> That front cabin is gonna pop its portholes. <laughs> hey, you two got a room now. Relationship updated again. Generous, eager, relaxed, excited. Okay, so his traits are getting better. Julia's about to get like eaten. The I ain't take the bank stick. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> it's not like we can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That's cheap. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, <laughs> dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid.
Sure. Why not? Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? Subdued, self-assured. Don't ask a lady about her money. It's a long story. Self-assured. You know it's not polite to ask a lady about her money. Fair enough. I was just thinking about buying a boat myself, and I thought maybe you'd like to point me in the right direction. Impressed, uninterested. Sorry, got enough on my plate. It would be my pleasure. Oh, uh, that's late. I'll say nothing. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. I don't want to lay it on too thick, you know? I kind of like them as a couple, so hopefully things work out. The instruction, the instructor identified on the rear is authorized to conduct classes in the designate special specialty as sanctioned by Dive Master Federation. Federation, said Federation. She's five eight, tall ass. That was super suspect. What was up? What was up with that? Why she gotta hide it? Can't go in there, I guess. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was actually anything there. This guy is so nerdy. So, how did you figure it out? Everyone was just looking at where the plane was headed. But I asked myself, where was the plane from? You know, where was that airbase? So I made some guesses based on that hypothetical return flight and I guess I guessed good. God, this guy's so nerdy. You can actually use all those old World War II stories to help them find the sites? Yeah. You know, when they started wreck diving, I realized I could be a pretty good resource. I knew a lot about where, where planes would go, shipping routes. You make a lot of connections. Alex and Julia have done a lot of dives, but I gotta say, finding this plane takes the cake. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. Going through her stuff again. Thought she was gonna like try and steal it or something. All right, guys, so I think I'm going to end this one right here. Um, we're almost at an hour. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Um, again, if you do, please remember to like and subscribe and stay tuned for the uh, second part, which will be out the following day. Um, so with that said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.